All right, people, Catfish Dave here. I put out a video a while back, several days ago, and I ended up catching a 60-pound fish, post-spawn fish, off this area right here. Uh, they were, as soon as I pulled up on the ledge, I just spotted fish. Ended up with probably six fish, couple close to 30, uh, and then the biggest was a 60. So I'm back at that same spot. When I first got here, uh, the fish weren't where I, uh, exactly where I was sitting. Uh, I pull up onto this ledge here in about 30 foot of water, and these fish are sitting up on top of this ledge right now. So I'm spotting them on my graph there. I'm gonna throw out the same bait I was catching the bigger ones with, which is white bass, and we can see we can catch another one of those good fish out here. As a YouTube cat fisherman, we don't mind catching big fish. So we're going to take advantage of the situation when we find it. I'm going to do like last time. I'm going to throw a couple baits out. I'm going to suspend a couple. I'm here a little later in the day than last time I caught them. Last time I caught them on the morning bite. But we'll see. It's supposed to be hot today in the 90s. Plenty of wind should help keep my camera cool. Now we'll see if these fish will bite later in the day. They should because it's post-spawn. They might not be as willing, but they should still eat. They're hungry this time of year. We should get something. Now I just hope we get something good. I'm gonna go ahead and start the day with a snack. Got me one of them boar's head Italian sandwiches. Look at that nasty old lettuce. The lettuce ain't supposed to look like that, y'all. That's how you get a case of the salmonella. We'll have to dissect this thing, get some of this stuff off here. I think that fish is on there. They don't let me eat my sandwich. can sit right there till I eat this sandwich. We got another one on there. Those fish can sit right there until I finish my sandwich.
It never fails if I try to eat something. Here they come. Now, if I was sitting out here hungry, nothing to eat, I wouldn't get a bite. Two fish to start off with. See the healed up scar where that fish has come off the nest. That old white bass is good stuff in the summer. Piece is awful chewed up, and I'll just reuse it. Good stuff right there. Looks like a pile of fish under the boat right now. We'll find out. There's a pile of fish under the boat. They're not fighting real great, but they are under there. He got hooked under the lip, but he still counts because he was looking at my bait. We're going to count him. That little thing there, man. Might be eating mussels. You see that butt hanging out? They're gorging. All right, y'all, we're dragging one. Got two suspended. We're moving a little bit. The bite's not that active this time of day. So we'll do this until we find one that's going to eat. Take long once we started moving to hit one. That fish is eating. Good old white bass. You just use it over and over and over. I don't like the rough water, but if the wind wasn't blowing, I couldn't video out here in these temperatures, so. I guess it's a blessing. It's supposed to get windier. It could get rough out here. We are in a bit of a dead, dead spell, but they'll pick back up. It's post-spawn. They're going to eat. That was a big fish that hit that and let go, but I could just tell. He let go of it right as I went to uh, reel down. That was a big one. He hit it and spit it.
Yeah, once we got to moving around, we're getting more activity again. And we did miss a big one on that dragon rod. We'll keep plugging away until we get that fat daddy. And I'll use that same piece of white bass all day long. That was another good fish again that let go of it. I should have reeled down. This wind's got me kicked sideways. Right as, right as I was fixing the reel down, he let go. That's a bigger fish doing that slower stuff. We ain't catching no size other than that, than that one big slow takedown, but we're starting to wear them out. Covering water, moving, it's paying off a little bit as far as numbers go. It's turning into one of those catfish beatdowns. Just using the same piece of bait over and over and over. Good old trusty white bass. All right, y'all, the water's getting rougher and rougher. The wind's getting rougher and rougher. The bite's getting rougher and rougher. I'm now dragging three. No suspended baits, just dragging three. Couple on boards, one straight down the back. caught so far. Oh shoot, I just got hit on that center rod. Yeah, this don't feel too bad. I'm going to stop this boat right here. He's way out there. He feels bigger than anything we've caught so far today. That's a short, fat barrel of a fish right there. Oh. Yeah. 
That's a barrel. Ain't getting no monsters, but we having us a catfish beat down out here. Covering some water. Getting into the slow part of the afternoon. Yeah, y'all. Yeah, That's a barrel right there, a little barrel fish. I got lines tangled up here. Feel too bad either. He's in it, y'all. We've got a serious mess. We got a mess, but we got him. Biggest fish of the day right there. Oh. Yeah, that's a barrel of a fish right there. He's heavy. Well, we got a mess. Oh, we got a mess, y'all.
I'm going to have to cut this loose. We're going to have to cut that. This thing here has actually got some weight to it, man. That's a barrel. That glass little barrel. <laughs> Old fat thing, man. Woo! I got a mess, but we done had us a catfish beat down. All right, y'all, this wind's bad enough. It's changed on what I want to do. And I've already caught plenty of fish and a pretty dang good one at the end. Pretty much a catfish beat down. So before it gets rougher out here, I'm a good ways from the ramp. I'm gonna call it a video. This is a video. There was fish in the video. That makes it a fishing video. This is Catfish Day with another one signing out.